Okay, question six, a nice, really short one mark question here. It just asks quite simply is money discrete or continuous? Well, money is discrete, and there's one reason is because, uh, because you can count it. And that means that, that continuous data is always like you can measure it more and more accurately depending on whether you have a stopwatch or a laser time or something like that. Um, or, or really better piece of equipment. Discrete means you can count it. It means there's chunks. You cannot, and this is a key point, you cannot have half pennies. So you can have half pounds, but you can't break it down. You can't keep breaking it down further than pennies, okay? You either have 1p or 2p or 3p. You don't have 1.1p or 1.5p or 3.697p. You have 1p or 2p. Nice and one.